Hello and welcome to a quick guide and video for muling. Basically in Diablo 2 there is this concept called mules and it is uh, naked characters with no gear and usually only level 1 that carries all your stuff and I just wanted to make a quick video about this because if you are playing Diablo 2 you're going to have to do this as you can see right now I'm on a character where I only have well three uh, level characters and the rest are all mules and the first tip I want to give is when you make a mule make the names easy so I have made mine uh, with some really good names uh, runes, jewelry charms, weapon shield gloves, belt boots, helm armor, be creative this can really really help when you're looking for that one item that can make or break a trade uh, when you're in a hurry to find something so this is uh, really important that you get uh, organized it's a bit nerdy it takes a long time but if you care for it you'll enjoy your mules a lot more and you can actually also start gaining more wealth because uh, you can find items fast to make public trades in the online games that goes quite fast say someone needs let's say uh, a rock belt and you don't have an rock belt on your main hell character guy you trade from you should be able to find it really really fast on a mule and then ask for him to join your mule game so yeah that is also the first thing I just wanted to mention another cool thing is that uh, you can have um, the account names really really short so my main account is named Nine of SB and then I only put two three and so forth in front of the account names so when I'm typing in my mule accounts I want to be able to log in really really fast not waste any time because usually I'm also muling an item uh, yeah oh no, I typed it wrong there you go okay so now I'm just gonna mule something to kinda show what muling is um, we could go into my bow amazon Oh, I shouldn't. So let's just um, two S's and then no character difference on normal difficulty. Now this is the risky mule. This one here I don't recommend for uh, anyone that is not kind of experienced. So I'm gonna draw my Umbro now, and now it's oh I actually named it DS. Oh, that's funny. Okay, but now I'm just gonna quickly go into the game now doing this kind of mule is really really fast where you instantly create a game really really fast log out of it really really quick but that is the most risky way to mule and it's one that I do not recommend doing but if you're in a hurry and you want to save time that is the way to go My pref but now let's uh, show the preferred way to mule um, I actually like now usually at least a non ladder Europe you can find games that are named park or park it even park in here uh, these are usually mule games that stayed up for a long time so it's a permanent game games become permanent after five minutes so you have no uh, way to lose it after quite a long time at least but um, let's go in and mule in a public game this one I like quite a lot so usually I will be going to Act 2 and then I have a favorite spot up here where I would drop an item um, yeah what should I mule well I don't really know what I should mule don't have anything to mule on this one but yeah then I would be dropping the item in the corner of course find your own favorite spot to drop items in as long as you um, do it kind of hidden but this is kind of my favorite spot in act 2 up in the corner here because nobody goes here and yeah another cool spot that I also really like if I'm in a hurry and I don't want to spend too much time is in cold plains so I will be going down here dropping items maybe past the uh, flavy and then I would be going down on this little corner here and drop it 
that is a pretty good uh, spot as well because it's close to the waypoint and whatnot. But yeah, find your own favorite uh, rule spot and then just kind of stick with it. The only thing you should really worry about is uh, relogging too many times. So when you're relogging mules, you shall wait. I'm just going to demonstrate it now. Oh, it's now locked out. And that's totally fine that I log out and all that shit. But I have to wait 20 seconds before I hit the escape button or quit down here at the corner. And when the 20 seconds are passed, it's perfectly fine to relog into another character. Um, yeah, 20 seconds, and that's basically just it. If you do that, you're probably never gonna see a, a disconnect. Just like I didn't see a disconnect when I did my last giveaway in that video. Because I wait 20 seconds before I hit the escape button. Um, yeah. Anyway, I think that's about it for all the muling. So yeah, I hope you found these tips useful and maybe you will start uh, being more organized yourself for even better profits or just having some fun with uh, being tidy and clean or whatever. <laughs> so yeah, hope you found this useful and goodbye.